Welcome to our Cocos 2D C++ tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many iOS developers encounter. Our viewer wants to know how to capture a screenshot of their app's current screen and attach it to a text message. They've already set up the message sending functionality, but they're unsure about where the screenshot is saved and how to use it. Let's dive into the details and find a solution together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To capture the screen in your Cocos 2D application, you need to use the Capture Screen function. This function allows you to take a screenshot and save it to a file. After capturing the screen, the next step is to handle the captured image. This is done in the after captured callback function. Here, you can check if the capture was successful and save the image. In the after captured function, you can save the screenshot using the render texture class. Make sure to specify the correct file name and format. Now, to attach the screenshot to your message, you need to ensure that the screenshot is saved in a location accessible by the messaging app. Typically, this would be the device's photo library. Finally, when you open the messaging app, you can use the appropriate API to attach the saved image. This will allow users to send the screenshot along with their message. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To save a captured screen image in Cocos 2D C++, it gets stored in the private application directory. You can access it using software like iExplorer, where you'll find it in the Documents directory. If you want the image to appear in your Photos app, you'll need to manually add it there. To do this, call the function UI Image Write to Save Photos Album. You'll need to create a function in AppController.m to handle this. You can call Objective-C code from C++, but first, load the UI image from the file path before adding it to the gallery. For more detailed guidance, check out the Stack Overflow link provided. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To capture and save an image in Cocos 2D using C++, you can create a render texture from a node's bounding box. First, initialize the render texture with the node's width and height. Then, begin rendering, visit the node, and end the rendering process. Finally, save the image to a file in PNG format. You can also implement a callback function to handle actions after the file is saved allowing you to manage the saved file path or perform additional tasks. And that's it. I hope that helped find the resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.